This is Ferrix, is it not? Yes, sir. Your sector, there was an unusual piece of naval equipment recovered. Miro wanted your crime report. You determined her request was out of order and in violation of the chain of command. That's not accurate. You advised me to reinforce my suspicions with data and to be careful in my work going forward. Careful? Is that your defense? You've been careful. I'd be curious how many people at this table will think it careful that you found a way to access our sector data without ever filing a request. Is that true, Tedra? Yes. I used the Imperial Emergency Act in the wake of Aldani to gather data across multiple sectors without official sanction, but that is the wrong question. I'd like to know if anyone here believes the Rebellion plans its actions around the artificially constructed boundaries of our sectors. Major Partagas created those sectors. As organizing principles, not personal playthings, do you really think the rebels care about the lines we draw on maps? You think the relevance of my work has been supplanted? Systems either change or die. Sir. Thesis, please. There is a focused, organized rebel effort to acquire highly restricted Imperial military components. Your evidence? By accessing unfiltered sector crime reports, I can now prove a link between the theft of our most secret equipment and its distribution to rebel groups across the galaxy. This is hard, verifiable data you are prepared to present? Yes, sir. I believe Supervisor Blevin is aware. I have a documented file ready to go. I believe his accusations here this morning have more to do with self-preservation than any sense of urgency. What's more urgent than a renegade intelligence officer? Imagine if everyone in this room played as loose with the rules as you. An excellent suggestion, Blevin. I'm wondering where we'd be right now if everyone here showed the same endeavor as Supervisor Mira. I'll have to think about that. For the moment, I'm reassigning the Morlana sector to Supervisor Mira. Ferrix is of great interest to her and has clearly become a distraction for you. I see no urgent problem, but as always, I salute the provocative exchange of ideas. Supervisor Grandy, you will accelerate your schedule. Young, I will expect your report on Old Mandel tomorrow. Thank you all for the lively session. Dedra Miro's confidence definitely expanded outside of the four walls of the ISB. I mean, obviously, we saw her confidence within the ISB heighten once she gained access to the Mor Morlana One sector. And then, then, of course, was put in charge on Ferrix to be able to run uh, the mission to search for Luthan Raw, aka Axis. Uh, but of course, that, you know, all of that was shut down basically once the riot happened and people were coming after her, basically, like how they were seemingly being like a mob of zombies like in in the walking dead and of course she gets saved by Cyril Karn and she shows signs of true fear true worry uh and of various of other emotions which in includes anxiety and to me it just seems like in these mo in this moment of being attacked by the Ferrix people that to me it just seems like all of that confidence went out the window and also too it feels like this is, was her very first mission out in the field as well, um, just because of the opposition that she came across uh, during the, the Ferrix ride and everything going on here. But, you know, she has confidence. It's there when she's in uh, very contained situations. But when these type of situations ex explode into more broader and more uh, dangerous things, I honestly feel like that confidence will get shattered and as of right now currently that confidence did get shattered here in episode 12 uh once she was once she was saved from 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 these people from by Cyril Korn uh again because I feel like this is just her her very first mission I'm going to be talking about Cyril Korn in another video to come this week but what do y'all think of this topic what do y'all think of the video uh what do y'all think of what occurred with uh Dedra uh here in the Andor series from start to finish with her character. Leave some comments, comment section below. Let me know your thoughts and remember the force will be with you always.